humans. In this episode, we're going to be taking a look at the 180 degree rule. Sometimes art has rules, humans. That's right. As a robot, I can't even understand the appeal of art, and I'm still able to school you guys about it. Pathetic. Anyway, when making your cool cutscenes using Cinema Suite's Cinema Director, there are some cinematic guidelines you should keep in mind. Here's one of them. In cinema, the 180 degree rule is something you should keep in mind when shooting and editing a scene. In essence, it's keeping the camera on only one side of the action. So it's like watching a play on a stage. It's called the 180 degree rule because the camera never moves for more than 180 degrees around the two subjects in a scene. Say you have two guys talking, draw a line going from one guy to the other, and we call that line the line of action, or the axis of action. If you were to cut to a camera on the opposite side of the line, like this, it comes across as a little weird, right? As a viewer, you lose track of where everything is in the scene. In most cases, you don't want to do this, it'll knock people out of it. You have to baby your audience a little bit more than that. They are just humans after all. <laughs> so what do you say? Huh? What about? You know, the, 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 uh, the pay's not great, but the work is hard. Are you up for it? Come on, what do you say? I have to say, I think you're being a bit rude. <laughs> This is important as it helps to maintain the consistency of direction and space. Without the line of action, the audience would be left confused about character direction. This imaginary line is usually drawn between the eyesight of two characters, but you are more than welcome to use your imagination when creating your line of action. And this doesn't just apply to two people having a conversation. Any interaction between two subjects has a line of action. And you should always keep that in mind when putting together your cutscene in Cinema Director. We call it a rule, but more accurately, it's just a general guideline to follow in order to avoid confusing your human audience. People can and do break it, sometimes to great effect. Here's an example. Famous human director Stanley Kubrick breaks this rule in his film The Shining. In this case, it's to create disorientation for the viewer. Lord of the Rings does the opposite of this. They have Gollum arguing with himself, and they use the 180 degree rule to convey his split personality. Anyways, that's it for this episode of Unity Tips. I'll catch you humans next time.